my gosh, they have tons and tons of sneakers. What is poppin' Legion Nation? Welcome back to another video on the channel. We are here in Kissimmee, Florida, which is right next to Orlando because we are here for Disney World. It is best family vacation, so we're out here. But while we were out here, I decided, you know what? Let's go ahead and hit up some Rosses. Let's go see what they got over here in Florida because every Ross is different, so you never know what you're gonna get. And I'm super excited because it is back to school season. So if you are going back to school, make sure you go check out my other videos because I've already done like six videos for back to school teaching you guys how to dress fresh anyways we're going to Ross right now and although today is not going to be a fully dedicated back to school video if you want to see back to school go watch my other videos but today we're gonna to go find some heat in the Ross it is a bright and sunny day and we don't know what we're gonna find yet but that is the journey that is the adventure that is the hunt here at Ross in Kissimmee I don't think I've ever been to this location before but that's even better cuz I mean bro we're about to find some steals. Yo, this place already looks packed. I cannot literally even see over the dresses. They have so much stuff in here. Oh my gosh. They have tons and tons of sneakers everywhere. I cannot believe how many sneakers they have here. In addition to the sneakers, they have racks and racks of clothing. You can't even see over the clothing. That's how much stuff they have here. All right, so your boy had to get a basket because there's just too many sneakers and I have no idea what we're about to cop today. But they have so much stuff today that I am super excited to show you guys. So let's go ahead and start with the hunt. Let's start digging and let's start seeing what we can find here. Okay, so first of all, I'm seeing this pair of J's right here. Let's see how much they are. $49, $50 for a pair of Air Jordan. That is cheap. Let's see what other shoes they have in here. Some LeBron soldiers in this like really big size blue colorway. Pretty clean, pretty clean for basketball season coming up. We got some more Jordans over here that I haven't seen in Ross yet. These are something new. These are $39.99 for these Jordans. These really pop, man. These are really popping. Okay, staying on finding the heat, we got on one of my favorite pairs. And these are like, I don't know the name of them, but they're like an Air Jordan runner with like a mixture of like a Jordan 4. So like you get a little bit of red with the running on it these are only $49 guys $50 for a nice pair of running shoes clutch hey look man I'm just gonna be straight up with y'all when I was your age guys when I was in middle school when I was in high school I really couldn't afford much so I ended up trying to dress the best but the only problem was was that I couldn't dress the best because I didn't have the money or so I thought but I didn't realize that you can dress fresher than everybody else without spending the money like there's so much heat in here that you can get. Look, check this out. We got some Steph Curry's right here to my left. These are some good basketball shoes. We got some other like Nikes in here. I think they're Nike. Oh no, these are actually Aldo's. What? Aldo entering the sneaker game? What the heck? We also got some Air Jordans over here in this gray colorway. These honestly remind me of like Adidas's uh, Harden shoe because it kind of like has the same features on it. But these are 49, all gray sneaker. You can match those with anything. We got some Adidas. Tubulars in here, some high tops right here for only $49 in this black and red bread colorway from Adidas. Coming down, guys. Keep going, keep going. We still got so much stuff to see, guys. We have so much. Some Roshis that really pop out on you for $22. The pink and green colorway. And we got some Air Jordans up here with that flight on the side. I think that looks pretty clean. The flight on the side for $54. These are actually really big, though. That's the only problem. They got some more. They got some of these Fenties right here. Oh, uh, I don't even know if I pronounce it right. Fen Fenty? Fen Fenty, I guess. I mean, it's kind of like a leather shoe. Rayana really put on these shoes for everybody. Like, I remember every girl was trying to get these these are $34 some LeBron lifestyles these have been in here for a while these are $34.99 some classy shoes you can pretty much like I feel like you could style these up the inside has like some really cool leather on it so that's kind of dope we got some more Air Jordans over here black colorway 64 99 all black we got more Jordans a lot of Jordans here but not really any retros just some regular Jordans but uh, there's a lot of reduced stuff these are on, on sale for $34 we got some Converse in here I think these are the Chuck Taylor 2's I've always wanted to try out the pair but I never bought the pair for $30 not bad for some Converse pretty cheap pretty cheap back to school shoe what are these down here I see like the Jordan logo on here okay little air bubble these are kind of fresh y'all $64.99 kind of fresh kind of fresh not gonna lie the adidas all black right here leather $34 some steph kirby's purple colorway the popping of purple and the gold 
almost like a Laker colorway, almost, almost, not a Laker colorway, but almost like a Laker colorway with Steph Curry on the background. I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. A dope pair of Alpha Bounces right here. These are pretty comfortable. I remember when I got my first pair for $45, not bad. This is like a good gym shoe or like a good lifestyle shoe. Then we got some Puma Clydes. What are these, yo? These have like ocean on it and stuff like that for $34. They have like water on it. That's kind of crazy. We got some Air Jordans right here with this like green glow colorway. <laughs> Pretty cool. Uh, 50 bucks. I thought these were Jordan 3s at first. When you see them like that, you think they're Jordan 3s until you see the back. You get that disappointment. But we also got some of the other Jordans that I was talking to you guys about. I think these are a youth size for only 20 bucks. $20. That is an extreme steal. But guys, yo, I found these back in Texas and I absolutely freaked out because, guys, Pink Dolphin is not as crazy as it used to be when I was in high school, but Pink Dolphin is one of the crazier, best brands that I think in my opinion. Um, so when I go to LA, I'm definitely gonna have to check out Pink Dolphin and cop some more stuff. I got like a hat so far. But anyways, guys, they have these Pink Dolphin X Puma shoes right here and they're a dope collaboration. I like the how the print goes on them It looks really classy and clean and then the back you got that pop of pink a little bit of like that like torn up look And uh, that's kind of unique on there too with the waves on the bottom But the, I think the the coolest part is the bottom of it because it has like the pink dolphin logo And then it has like the little shades of like the different waves and these are $20.99 with that silver aglet on there. And oh my gosh, guys, I cannot believe it. We found some clickbait Jordans, the bottom of a Jordan 13 for $60. And these are in all red colorway, $60 ain't that bad. I've never tried these guys. Let me know in the comments if y'all think these are comfortable or not. Real quick question of the day, guys, listen. So I know back in the day, I used to be heavy, heavy, heavy into Air Jordans. I used to absolutely love Air Jordans. I had a good, solid Jordan collection. Hi. But now I'm rocking with more of the Adidas. So I'm rocking some Adidas right now. So I like to get Adidas. So let's see if we can find any Adidas over here. There's some more Air Jordans over here in an Air Jordan runner colorway in an all gray. But here's another pair of those Jordans that we just saw right now, guys. And these are actually in a navy colorway. And these are going to be $65. Let's see what else we can find. There's some Boost over here too. Some Adidas Boost. Okay. These are going to be $40. $9.99 with the boost in there something like this is okay I mean I wouldn't really rock this every day but if you're gonna get athletic wear out of it then I mean that's the that's the goal I would say wear these more for like an athletic look rather than like an everyday look we got some simple Jordans kind of like a Space Jam colorway these are alright they're not that cool then you got some some like aqua colored ones. They seem like they would look like almost running shoes, almost. Now, like I said, Adidas are dope, but I don't know about something like this. Like the clunky look, I don't really know when it comes to Adidas. Like I still think they're kind of fresh, but I don't think I could pull this off. Maybe if they had Boost on the bottom, that would. I see, I feel like Boost changed the game, guys. I feel like at first Nike had it when they had the Nike Airs and stuff, but then when Adidas came out with Boost, they completely, completely innovated the game and changed it up. We got some Westbrook Jordans down here in an all black colorway with a little hint of gold, and these are $41 black leather on there pretty nice pair of shoes I think these are kind of dope I know we really never cover any classy shoes on the channel but these are pretty classy dude these are really nice guys like sometimes you're gonna want to dress up too when you're going back to school these are 20 bucks for size 10 and a half so these are my size but an all white pair of shoes guys y'all want to make sure in your wardrobe that you have a little bit of everything a little bit of variety when it comes to dressing up and dressing down because like you don't want to make the mistake to wear all you have is sneakers and then when it comes to the point to wear like you have to dress up and you have to do something uh, dressier you don't have no shoes and you have to wear sneakers that is probably like one of the biggest mistakes so make sure you get a little bit of everything a little bit of a variety that way you can be in your sneakers and be fresh but also still be in the classy shoes yo and I just saw these at the bottom from the corner of my eye they look like Adidas NMDs but they're like low tops but they, they don't have any boosts like they're not running shoes they're like the tubular low tops I want to say for like $34 dang I've never seen this pair of shoes before. Yo, what did we find here? Like a collaboration of Adidas or something? $39.99. I'm not sure the official name on these guys, but these are looking crazy. They even have like something hanging out of this. It's like an off-white color on the front and then you got leather with a little bit of distressing and you got like a chicken. Is this like supposed to be like the year of the chicken or something like that? I have no idea what it is, but it has like some Asian prints inside there. This is a, this is a fresh pair of shoes, guys. This is super clean right here for $39.99. This is a fresh pair of kicks. Yo, we got some Adidas EQTs in like a little youth size in this olive green, maybe like a 
like an army green type of colorway for $54. That's pretty, pretty cool. I haven't found any of these in here. So I'm not really a huge fan of Puma. Like, I mean, to me, Pumas are all right, but this is, they're, they're getting creative with their styles, guys. The Puma Clydes with the Clyde on the side. And not only do you have white laces, but you have white and black laces in there. That is, that's different. I don't see, you never see any Jordans with Jordan on the side or anything like that. Unless you're talking about the off-white collab because they have air on the side, but other than that, I don't think I've ever seen any shoe company do that before. Some Flynets in here for $62. Lunar Lund Soul. These must be super comfortable. Yo, and some more free ones right here in this green and gray color. This is really popping. Like a like a Volt colorway for $39. These are really good running shoes, guys, if you ever wondered. With the KDs right here. KDs in here in this blue colorway. Size eight and a half for 62 bucks. He wants his mom, but we found the KDs in here. All right, so the shoes were good. We found a lot of crazy shoes. There's so many shoes in here. Probably one of the biggest shoes sections that I've seen in any Ross, but it's time. Let's check out the shirts and let's see what they got in the shirts because we're in Disney right now and your boy might need some new tank tops. So, okay, first of all, they got this Los Angeles, California shirt, which is fresh. Cut a little bit of color, colors on it for only five bucks, guys. Five bucks for this shirt. Extremely cheap. Size extra large, unfortunately. Your boy lost weight. Well, I wouldn't say unfortunately. But your boy lost some weight, so I ain't wearing extra large no more. We also got this slim fit flamingo shirt right here. This one is $12.99. Not bad, not bad. We got some a little bit of athletic wear in here for the gym. $16.99. We got a, a little diamond logo on this pink shirt right here. Come up on a Stranger Things shirt right here. If you guys are fans of Stranger Things, they got a Stranger Things shirt in here. This is something I'd probably buy, guys. Guest USA jeans. Just the classic guest logo with the pops of gold. Got a little pops of gold on the side. Nice pink shirt. Very, very good material. Pretty soft for $12.99. Not bad. The shirt with the rose on it. An all-white t-shirt with just the rose symbol. $8.99. When it's time to dress up, we got the Tommy Hill figure shirts in here. Super soft shirt with the Tommy logo in here all red Tommy Hilfiger this one is $20 the classic Nike shirt that you could pretty much wear with anything this one is $12.99 an all red shirt with Nike on the front they actually got two of them so it's not Nike on the back there's nothing on the back but yeah Nike on the front super simple Rocco's Modern Life I remember watching this show way back when size extra large in this tank top another guest shirt in here this one's kind of more for dressing up this one has the guest embroidered on there stitched $19.99 guest sleeve guest patch on the side we got something a little cooler something by a brand called good day with a palm tree and it looks like this is almost like kind of like an acid wash right here yet again another fresh guest shirt with the all-white colorway this one would be perfect for summer for $8.99 and if you're looking for summer shirts we got some loud loud summer shirts in here for $7.99 we got another one though for $10.99. This one looks like it would stay, stay cool and you'd be loud and you'd be fresh for the summer. Yo, they got your boy's taco shirt in here, son. You already know $10.99 taco shirt. I actually just bought this shirt before it went with my family on vacation, so I just got this one. And this is a really, really loud lion shirt. Now, one thing that I want to talk to you guys about is there's a difference between dressing to impress and, and, and dressing fresh and being too loud, okay? That's one mistake that I think I made in high school is I was just a little too loud when I would dress Dress up with my outfits so I wouldn't just wear like regular colors or regular shirts like this I would wear like the loudest stuff so I would wear like a loud shirt with like a big necklace and like a colorful belt with like a snapback hanging on my pants and like colorful jeans and like you know just really big popping sneakers and that's something that maybe some of y'all don't want to do because it can hurt you more than it can help you so it can kind of hurt the outfit if you dress a little too loud so kind of dress fresh dress loud but don't dress too loud and don't overdo it with your style and just got out of another successful day from shopping at Ross I got a little bag here that I'm about to show you guys but real quick before I show you guys you know what let me let me let me just go in and show you guys <laughs> all right so let's see what's in the big bag of Ross mystery guys I ended up copying those Adidas that I was showing you guys that I really, really enjoyed if I can get them out of the bag. Guys, I ended up copying them because like, think about it, man. When do you see chicken shoes? Like how often do you see freaking chicken shoes? No, honestly guys, and honestly, the leather is just killing it on these shoes. Like they are super nice shoes. They're different. That's what I like about them the most. But these the guys can be pretty much used for beaters. You can pretty much wear them like every day, kind of take them everywhere, just slip them on whenever you're going places. 
and then I really like the toe box because if you look at most Adidas most of the toe boxes are just white this one's kind of like more of like a cream colorway so I don't know I really like the way these were so I had to go ahead and cop for only $40 now if you're looking for a spot to go get back to school shoes Ross is probably going to be the cheapest place that you can get back to school shoes of course you can go to pay less and you can go to cheaper stores but you're not gonna get the same like I guess good quality shoes as Ross does because Ross carries Nike Adidas you're not really gonna find those good brands at stores like Payless and then you can also do like thrift stuff but the thrift is really really you're taking a really high chance of finding shoes there like I remember back in the day I used to go and find all kinds of stuff now you can't even go and find any pairs of shoes so I would stick with Ross and then other stores would be like Marshalls and maybe, maybe, maybe TJ Maxx. But I don't think TJ Maxx really carries guy stuff. They mostly carry like women's stuff. So I would say Ross is your best bet for if you're going to find the cheapest back to school shoes for the good quality. Guys, you got to check out Ross. But let me show you guys what else I cop. So I also went ahead and bought this pink guest shirt right here. And it's like a pink and gold type of shirt. And this one was only $13, so it was a pretty good price. But this one is kind of more classier. I kind of like brands like Guess and stuff because the material of the shirt is really soft, not like Supreme or Bape or anything like that, where it's kind of like a harder material. This one's like real soft, and I really like to wear like softer shirts. But yeah, guys, that was the video for today. If you enjoyed it, make sure you guys please, please, please leave me a big thumbs up so that way I know that you guys are enjoying the videos and that you are enjoying going back to Ross. This is Tim, aka the Ross Boss, signing out. Guys, Guys, leave me suggestions down in the comments down below I want you guys to comment it up man and tell me where you want me to do a back-to-school shopping video at and I will drop one as soon as I can at your spot I have a bunch of other spots left to do but we are here in Orlando so the only thing that was near the hotel was pretty much Ross so I ended up doing a Ross one today but let me know where else you guys want to see and I'll see you guys in the next video peace homies stay blessed we're out of here What's up guys? Thank you so much for watching that episode. If you did enjoy it, make sure you smack up that thumbs up button. And if you're not already a part of the Legit Nation, hit that subscribe button. Turn my post notifications on. I'm a 20-year-old kid living in San Antonio, making my dreams become a reality. Join the journey and I'll see you guys tomorrow in the next one.